Bullet, why are you so afraid of garbage bag? It's a garbage bag. So one of the things that I'm trying to be significantly more conscious of is like when I look at these analytics for YouTube, uh, even things as like comments and, and you know, just how the videos are doing and while I find it actually very important to do so, I have to be in the right state of mind. I've learned that sometimes I'll just start comparing myself, I'll start being getting down on myself if I'm not in the right state of mind and I just want to recommend that to you when you're feeling good about things and when you're not because like if you have to do some things but you know that if you do it at this this time of day or when you're feeling like that, it's not gonna help, it's actually gonna hurt more than help, then maybe do it at a different time. Like I need to be in the right state of mind to see how a video is performing. And sometimes I don't even want, sometimes it's honestly best not even to look because it's already up there. It's already looks like it's doing well or not doing well. And I don't need to know if it has 500 or a thousand views. It doesn't change my pattern so much, you know, that it, I need to check it every couple of hours or even once a day. Like, it's learning when it's important to check these things and when it's not important to check these things. More than music. All right, we are back to the original lens that I had on my camera, the one that the kit lens is called. Uh, can you guys tell the difference? I'm curious, uh, but it's, it's a significantly smaller. It's like a third of the size, so I have to travel now, heading out to my parents' office, so it's a lot easier to travel with this guy than just that huge one over there. Look at the size of this one. Like, it's, it's huge. All right, so here we are. It is uh, 1 11 p.m. and we are about to send out proof of the promise to be released. Uh, my goal is for this Friday, but I mean, which is probably when this vlog will be ended up being released. Uh, but funny thing in there is in there is there's a, a slight timing on the guitar mistake. I could go into Logic and fix it, but I'm like, I fixed this song so many times. It's like the last two seconds of the song. It's not gonna make or break the song. It's fine, so I'm just gonna leave it. I don't really care. You ever have those moments? I just got back from meeting somebody that I've spoken to for years on the phone. Years, like, I mean, it's nothing special. It was our insurance person. But it's so funny, like, I've spoke, I spent hours on the phone with him when we bought this house and buying new car, with James' new car, and even for my parents, who was my parents' guy at first. But I've spoken to his receptionist, I've spoken to him, like, countless times. And, like, you ever have those experiences where, like, you, you meet them and you're like, that is not what I expected you to look like. It's so funny, man. Like I to totally thought the receptionist was kind of like in her her like late 50s, 60s, you know, kind of just old school. And like, I totally thought he was this kind of young, but not super hip looking, like, you know, totally wrong. This guy was hip, he was chiseled, he had a beard. His, his assistant was like, probably like in, in her 40s, but like it was definitely like a mom, like trendy, wearing trendy. It was like so funny. It's like, wow, I had no clue that this is who I was gonna meet today. It was just one of those experiences where I would have, like, you know, you can't judge a book by its cover. It was very, very funny. Well, are you just hanging out in my chair? What are you doing under here? Just chilling while I'm ending some videos? Just hanging out, huh? You're a good boy. Yo, it's funny, man. It's like eight o'clock. It's actually eight o'clock on the dot, and I'm exa I'm like ready for code bed. Exhaust. It's funny how like consistently getting going, getting up early, makes me mad tired at night.